falling to pieces in my room. Are you coming over? That's cool. Good morning, guys. I just picked up my South by Southwest badge. This is what it looks like. Super official. Basically, if you're new here, I'm Audrey. Um, I go to the University of Texas. I live in Austin. South by Southwest is like... I still don't know how to describe it, and I'm still, like, interested to see how it is. But basically, it's like this big conference, film festival, music festival. Not really, like, music festival the way you're thinking it. It is always during our spring break, and so instead of going on a little beach vacation like I usually do, I'm staying and doing South By. I bought an interactive badge, which is, like, the second highest. And it doesn't get me into the film and music stuff, but it does get me into, like, all the talks and featured sessions so i just feel like this week i'm gonna learn a lot it's thursday right now i just picked this up and oh i also got this little tote i picked up a map and this thing whatever this is anyways welcome to the vlog i think i'm going to vlog tomorrow which is my first day this weekend is like my busiest days I think I've been like starting to put my schedule together. I have a couple influencer events I'm going to. It's just gonna be exciting. And so today's just gonna be kind of a day in my life vlog. I'm gonna start it tomorrow and then um I'm also gonna film like the rest of the week. We're just gonna see how it goes. Um but yeah, I also got my nails done yesterday and I am obsessed with them. I got gel X for the first time. This camera has an issue uh zooming sometimes. I really should get that fixed. Yeah, welcome to the vlog. I am nervous for this week, but very excited. I do think it's gonna be like overwhelming and exhausting but so fun and i think i'm gonna learn so much and i'm really excited i also paid way too much for parking to just go pick up my batch but whatever Good morning guys, it is Friday and the first day of South By. My little badge, I'm gonna put it on. I was waiting to put it on until I was on camera even though it's literally such a tiny little detail. Okay, what I'm wearing was not what I had planned but I looked up the weather this morning and it's raining and it's cold. So, um, I'm wearing these Aritzia trousers, my on sneakers because I feel like I'm gonna walk a lot. I have a long day today. Then I have this little free people sweater that has a hood oh i need to pack my umbrella and then just a brady melville white tee under it okay my bag i was in between a backpack and my usual tote but i think i'm gonna bring this tote in it i have my computer with my little amazon case a notebook i can't tell which one i'm gonna take notes on so i'm bringing both this has just pens other essentials a little snack bag I don't really know what the food situation is gonna be like um, but I'm gonna be downtown so I could always go get food somewhere a little map glasses charger oh in here I have like a portable charger Let's see what else I have in here airpods aquaphor stuff like that packing my hydro flask then I'm driving because I think that'll just be easier and cheaper honestly like it's $20 for parking all day so better than ubering so I'm gonna leave this in my car because I have a few events tonight that I might either want to change for or like in my purse um, a little makeup bag just to retouch up because I think I'm gonna be there <laughs> until like nighttime and it's 7 it's 8 o'clock right now 8 16 so I'm about to leave I think I'm gonna go to the opening talk at 10 but I'm gonna get there a little early just to like walk around and I'm really nervous, but I'm excited. I just am nervous because I have absolutely no idea what to expect. Okay, I have made it parked. Um, one, it seems very cold outside. I like kind of went outside because I went to my garage to get to my car. But like now I'm kind of worried because I get so cold so easily and like everyone's like bundled up on the street. 
Um, okay. I, like, don't know what to do now. I do, but I'm, like, scared to leave my car now. This vlog, first of all, I'm just, like, I'm a little out of my element, so just bear with me, please. I'm trying to, like, navigate the app. This, like, opening session is at the convention center, so I think I'm gonna go to that, although I do have something at 11.30 right after, but I think I have enough time to go to it. I don't want to go to this thing at 11.30, like, <laughs> because it's a workshop, and so I'm just kind of scared that it's gonna be, like, a lot of, like, talking and meeting people, but I'm gonna go to the opening speaker because I feel like that'll be an easy start. Um, it doesn't start till 10, though, and it's 8.47, so... I think I might go walk around and just kind of soak in everything, get my bearings straight. Keep sneezing, my allergies are so horrible. I am currently sitting at the JW Marriott, this little couch. Uh, the first talk isn't here, but like a lot of my talks are here this week. So I'm just looking around before I actually have somewhere to be. Finishing my yerb before I'm gonna go to the bathroom and then I'm gonna head over to the convention center where the like welcome talk is I also looked at the room where the one that I'm really nervous to go to that I don't want to go to is and it made me less intimidated So I'm just gonna do it because that's what this week is about is getting out of my comfort zone And I would be cheating myself if I just did not go to something I was scared to go to so <sighs> Yeah, I just wanted to update y'all because y'all are my only friend today <laughs> Actually, no, I'm probably, I'm meeting one of my coworkers later. But yeah, this is like the huge hall. There's like a ton of different like activations kind of thing, but I'm too scared to go into any of them right now, but maybe later. It's the first 30 minutes. I did what I was supposed to. There's nothing left for me to do. So now I'm poking out my head through open windows. Cause that's what I feel like. First one was really good, really inspiring. I didn't stay the whole time because I was like anxious to get to the RSVP one. That one was so good, not as intimidating as I thought it was going to be, but it was good. And now I'm about to meet up with my coworker at my internship. She's bringing me food, and then we're going to another session at 2:30 together. You want me to say something? I come up with nothing. Maybe we can talk and. Leah picked me up and we're going to an influencer event that I got invited to for Prime Video. So we're on South Congress now. It's like 4.30. The event started at 4. So I think it's like a come and go thing. Yeah. We'll see. But I'm nervous. But I kind of left some stuff in the car. Then I'm going to go back later after this. But right now we're on South Congress and it's gonna we're going to see the stuff like around here. Okay, we're, we're regrouping in the car because that was a very interesting experience and I don't know if I want to go back. Basically, wait, I'm going to show you music. Basically, we got there and it's like outdoors. There's like a loud DJ and drinks and stuff, but it was like a weird crowd. No one was like mingling with each other. We're also... We saw some like famous TikTokers there and ev okay, ev everyone is also dressed so cute and like I'm so coming from my like South cute. by outfit and everyone's in like the most trendy LA influencer outfits, which I guess like, yes, we were literally going to an influencer event, but I thought that because it was South by it like wasn't going to be like that, but it was, um, so we left. <laughs> we might come back we might go back but we also like got they because of the show i guess there's like a convenience store like um gas station thing so we got five dollars to spend there but then they didn't have bags so we were, so got, we were supposed to go back into the party with like all our junk food in our hands so that wasn't so we came back to the car to drop it off and then i think we're gonna go to another thing on South Congress and then possibly go back to the party. I have a goal to talk to at least one person, but it's really <laughs> intimidating and very yeah. I'm gonna look some people up on TikTok that I saw. <laughs> oh 
Okay, I'm back to my car. It's six something and I have like 30 minutes to chill out before I go to my next thing, which is like this comedy special thing. I don't know, Anna Kendrick's gonna be there. So that's the only reason why I'm going, even though I'm really tired. Just walked upstairs, so I'm out of breath. But that was like really emotionally draining for me just because I felt so out of my element and so out of place. <sighs> we did go back and we talked to more people and it was fine. Um, I think also just like my outfit, I felt out of place, whatever. Anyways, so I'm sitting in my car, debriefing, a little relaxing. I use the word debriefing a lot and I don't think I use it correctly, so just ignore that if I don't. And I have an assignment due tonight at 11.59, so I'm probably gonna work on that before I go to my other event, so I'm just gonna chill in here for a sec. Okay, I'm ready to go out again. I just wish I would have brought more of a change of clothes because I feel like now it's nighttime and everyone's gonna be in like cute going out outfits and I'm still like in my trousers, but that's okay. I think I'm also just feeling still like embarrassed and out of place from the last event, but it's over now, so I need to get over it. It is 11, I'm just now getting home. I'm gonna go to sleep. And I'm really tired, but the day was so good. It was so good. I am actually excited to wake up and do it all over again. I'm just really tired, so I'm gonna go to sleep. I would film my nighttime routine for y'all, but like I literally am just like so tired. So I love you all, bye. Good morning, it is day two, Saturday. Um, feeling fine. I am breaking out in stress hives a little. Um, I think I just, I don't know. Personally, I'm not doing the best but everything else is like going fine. So whatever, we're gonna push through. I really like my outfit today, so change up from yesterday. But yeah, I'm here, I'm chilling. I'm going to kind of drink my Yerba Mate, update my stories. Um, I'm waiting for Laura, who's my coworker, to get here, because we're going to the first session together. And it's gonna be a good day. I am a little tired from yesterday, but it's okay. All right, hello. I basically stopped filming, but I still want to give y'all a recap of this week. So I really got the hang of things like this vlog. I was kind of like so scared, but I went to so many panels. There ended up being like a lot of lines. I actually missed like two that I really wanted to go to because of the lines. But overall, I went to most of the marketing panels and then some random ones and I learned so much. It was so cool. Every day was a very full day. I got to talk to GBT, Robin, Girl Boss Town, however you know her. And she was so sweet. I asked her a lot of advice after her panel, which was really cool. And then one of my favorite things that we did, and it was like kind of spontaneous, but we were walking down the street and we saw that there was like a movie premiere. And our passes like don't have the film priority stuff, but we still went and it was Self-Reliance by Jake Johnson. It was like his first time directing something and Anna Kendrick was in it and it was so cool. And then afterwards, the next day, we got to go to the panel of Jake Johnson talking about the movie. He also talked a lot about New Girl and then we met him afterwards, which was so cool. I went to another influencer event with Bumble and Quinn, which was so cute and much better experience than the first one if I'm being honest like it was so adorable I went to a gifting suite from Clarins and then just like a lot of free stuff by South by in general I went to this cool like Shopify house that had Emma Chamberlain stuff I got to try her matcha and just like Mr. B stuff I got some freebies there then I always like ate lunch at the slack house because they always had food I got like this tart goodie bag like Every brand kind of just had like these houses that you could go to. So I went to a lot of those in my free time. For South by also had like a lot of social stuff. So there was like happy hours after the panels. And then we went to this Danish <laughs> get together because we also wanted food. And it was on this cool rooftop. And that was my week. It was so amazing. 
and I love you all so much. I know this isn't like my usual kind of outro, but I hope you have a great day. Thanks for following along with me. I love you all so much, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.